Jesus said, Therefore shall a man leave mother and father and cleave unto his wife. You follow? Hear that word? Cleave to his wife? Amen. My God, you have a wife and you cleave to her, you're bound. You don't get out after that. Am I right? Amen. <laughs> you know what that means, right? <laughs> if you have a wife and you cleave unto her, you're bound. F do you part. See, if you have a wife you haven't cleaved up to, then you're not bound. <laughs> Make it sense? Amen. If you have a wife and you have not cleaved up to her, you're not bound. Look at the book of Matthew, the 19th chapter. Let's see what the good book says. The Pharisees, they came unto Jesus. <clears throat> let's, see what, let's see if the book backed me up. You're not bound to just a wife. You're bound to a wife you have cleaved to. Amen. You understand? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ain't that what the word says? Yep. The word don't just say wife. It say cleave unto his wife. Let's, let's see what the book says. Read. The Pharisees also came unto him. The Pharisees came unto Jesus. Tempting him. Tempting Jesus. And said unto him. And said unto him. Is it lawful for a man to put away his wife for every cause? See, you gotta understand when they asked Jesus this, they were talking about Deuteronomy, the 24th chapter. And they wanted to know is it lawful for a man to put away his wife for every cause? Why? Read. And he answered and said unto them, Uh huh. Have you not read? Yeah. That he which made them at the beginning. See, God, Jesus, taking them to the beginning. Mm -hmm. Bypassing old Moses in his divorce. Have you read in the beginning? See, that's where we want to go to. You follow me? Amen. We want to go to the beginning. Read. Made them male and female. Are you a male? You know what makes you a male, don't you? Amen. Are you a female? You know what makes you a female, don't you? Amen. Read on. And said, for this cause, for this cause, shall a man leave father and mother. A man shall leave father and mother, and shall cleave to his wife. Oh, see, it's a way here. You see what it says? And cleave to his wife. You can have a wife you haven't cleaved to. You understand that? Oh yeah, you can have a wife you haven't cleaved to. In the book of Matthew, one and eighteen, let's see Joseph. Let's see if Joseph cleaved up to marry yet. Let's see here. Let's see if I'm uh, in the Word. Find it for me to read it. Chapter and verse. Matthew 1 and 18. Matthew 1 and 18. Now the birth of Jesus Christ. Now the birth of Jesus Christ. Was on this wise. Was on this wise. When as his mother Mary. Mary. Was espoused. Check that word espoused. See, don't jump, don't run. Expouse means betrothed, engaged. So he was exposed to Mary. Go ahead. When as his mother Mary was espoused to Joseph, uh -huh. before they came together, they had not cleaved. You follow me? You see here? That was Joseph's wife, but they had not cleaved. They had not joined. But it still was his wife. You follow me? Before they came together, the Bible says, she was found a child of the Holy Ghost. So watch it. Hmm? People don't understand there's two different types of wives. There's an ex-spouse wife and there's a spouse wife. Am I right? <laughs> Am I right? There's two kinds of wives. And this is exposed wife. Is that what it says? Mm -hmm. Read it again. When as his mother Mary. As when if his mother Mary. Was espoused to Joseph. Exposed to Joseph. Right. Read. Before they came together. Before. See the reason why they was exposed. Because they had not cleaved. They had not joined. So God having put them together. So therefore. They don't have to worry about being put asunder. Follow me. Amen. The Bible said, Therefore shall a man leave mother and father and cleave unto his wife, and they shall be 
be one flesh. Joseph was not one flesh with that. And once they are one flesh, therefore would God have joined together. Not the preacher. Not the preacher. But would God have joined together? How you think when you connect with someone, who you think you getting that from? Why you think if you don't do it properly, God call your dog to a fornicator? Because hmm? he have a way designed for male and female to come together. And if you don't do it the way God has designed, my God, you have broken the law. And the Lord is going to call you a fornicator, a dog to the homeowner. Am I right? Keep on reading. She was found with child of the Holy Ghost. Yeah. Now jump on down into like, the, what is it, 25th verse? Read that. Matthew 1 and 25. Yeah. And knew her not. What? And knew her not. Let's get the 24th verse. Read the 24th verse. Then Joseph, being raised from sleep. Joseph, being raised from sleep. Did as the angel of the Lord had bidden him. And did what? Read and took unto him his wife. See, take. See, listen. When you're engaged, you take a wife. Right? Some people are given in marriage. Some people don't. In the old times, you wouldn't even know who the person was. Your father, your mother, give you away to someone. Right? You be given in marriage. Or you take a wife. But you still have to join her to marry her. See, Joseph took her as a wife, but he still wasn't married. That would prove Joseph wasn't married. The Bible said, what read it? And knew her not. And knew her not, meaning what? He didn't cleave to her. That's right. Therefore, he wasn't bound yet. But he still took her as a wife. You follow what the scripture said. You follow what the scripture said. He took her as a wife, but he wasn't bound yet. Why? Because he knew her not. You follow me. And I'm going to show you that Joseph was not married to her. Read Luke. Second chapter of the book of Luke. And uh, get in there somewhere where the after Caesar had taxed the whole world. How Joseph and Mary went up to be taxed out there in the city of David because there was of a, Joseph was of the house of David. And read from there. Read. You got it? Luke 2, 3. Read. Luke 2 and 3. Uh-huh. And all went to be taxed. Uh-huh. Everyone into his own city. Yeah, read. And Joseph also went up from Galilee. Joseph went up from Galilee. Out of the city of Nazareth. Out of the city of Nazareth. Into Judah. Into Judah. Unto the city of David. Unto the city of David. Which is called Bethlehem. Which is called Bethlehem. Read on. Because he was of the house of lin and lineage of David. That's right. Read. To be taxed with Mary, his espoused wife. Who? Mary his who? To be taxed with Mary his espoused wife. He's still engaged. Good God of my man. Still engaged. Haven't married her yet. Why? Because he knew her not. And, and look. Look how long it was. Read. Be, being great with child. She was big. <laughs> my God. They've been together for a while. He couldn't go in there. Why? Because the Lord still was up in there. <laughs> he had to wait. <laughs> Am I right? Amen. He had to wait till the Lord come up. Amen. Am I right? Amen. Hmm? Am I right? Amen. Joseph's still engaged. Amen. That man ain't married yet. What did he say again? His white wife read. To be taxed with Mary, his espoused wife. Me betrothed. Engaged. He's still engaged. People don't understand the scriptures. 